Hey guys, I'm Chris. Welcome back to the channel. Today we have another product review from our friends over at KESI. Today we're looking at the torque station. As you guys know, I am a bit of a tool junkie. Obviously I am a mechanic, so tools are a big part of my life. And uh, I'm constantly buying new tools. So. I recently discovered this company and they make some pretty cool stuff. I just did a video on their bit set that I'm really excited to have, but I now have this torque station that I'm also excited to have. So what this is, is a small torque wrench that ranges from two to 10 Newton meters. It's a 72 tooth ratchet. It has patented anti-strip bits. It's mini size is easy to carry. Voice notified of reaching to torque. Oh, it, that's just their way of saying it clicks when you've reached the torque. And uh, it comes with a magnetic organizer. So this is a pretty cool little unit here. So you're gonna get a torque wrench, a magnetic bit holder, and then it comes with an assortment of bits, but any quarter inch bits will work with this unit. Any quarter inch bits you might have will work with this unit. So you're gonna get a H3, H4, 5, 6, and then a T15, 20, and 25, and then a quarter drive socket adapter. So let's, let's crack this bad boy open, take a closer look at it. So in this box, there was this chart here, a conversion chart, newton meters to foot pounds. And then this looks like a certificate for the calibration and then your instructions. So in this, in the packaging, you've got a small tin for parts. I would assume you could while you're working on something, you could put your small screws in this tin. I'm assuming that's what this is for. You have a magnetic base that holds an assortment of bits. And um, it doesn't come with a lot of bits, but it comes with just some common bits. Oh, these are, these are special too. These are even like a shorter, shorter Torx bit or tor uh, shorter, um, what do I want to say here? Shorter bit, quarter drive bit, either way. Nice little uh, magnetic holder, and the base is magnetic too. I, this desk is steel. <laughs> anyway. And then finally, our little adorable little quarter drive torque wrench. So here's how you could, you could use it as a regular just quarter drive torque wrench, put quarter inch drive sockets on here. It is reversible. Um, however, I, you would never ever want to use this to loosen a bolt um, that can screw up the torque mechanism and you don't want to do that. You want to keep these things accurate as possible. Also, um, quick side note, when storing a torque wrench, you want to store it at zero. You don't want to leave it at a preset ever when you're storing a torque wrench. But pretty simple mechanism here. You just turn your uh, oh, it's locked. <laughs> it's got a lock. So you will turn your pull out on the bottom of this handle, and then turn your torque up to whatever torque spec you want. Let's say it's. Two point, uh, let's just go to five. 
five newton meters. Lock it in place and then you will uh, tighten up your bolt. And once you get to the torque spec, it will click. But I don't know that I can hold this and give you that audible click. And when you're done, you will just, there's a little gauge here I'm looking at. Probably should show you that. You see it's set on five Newton meters. And then when you're done, you'll just pull this out and back it back off to, uh, to zero. And that's how you store it. Nice little, nice little kit right there. Stores right here in your, your magnetic base. So it's ready to go at any moment, whenever you need it. So this is great for small, small items. Like if you're into airsoft maybe, and you need to torque down some uh, scope rings or uh, maybe you have base plates on pistols for RMRs, this thing would be super handy and necessary to torque those things down. It's not a lot of torque, but you do need to torque them to spec and evenly. That way they never fall off because that would be bad. And then also you could use this for, I mean, it, it'll work as a torque wrench for any application as long as it's within the specifications of this torque wrench. But um, a lot of bicycle guys might run into those smaller torque uh, specifications, you know, automotive, not so much. I, I think everything's uh, at a much higher torque spec than this little wrench does. Um, but maybe if you're into uh, watchmaking or <laughs> I don't know, but anytime you need a small torque wrench, this is a very good option. They're not very expensive and it's a very handy, handy little kit. So that's pretty much it for that. It's not much to it. It's a nice little torque wrench and will come in handy here for getting things dialed in. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. Do me a favor, click that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up, and we will see you in the next video. KESI tools for the win. Thanks guys. Oh, there'll be a link in the description below if you're interested in one of these for your air sauce. See you guys.